welcome to the Dubai International Stadium for either Australia or Sri Lanka today, making it two from two. Toss was won there by Aaron Finch. He's going to bowl first. Let's just uh, remind ourselves of what we've got today. This uh, Australian side who think they're think they're good. I mean, they really believe in themselves. And Sri Lanka, who emerged from the preliminary stage of the tournament with a lot of confidence. So, two teams who who really think they have an opportunity here. It's nicely into line. Tucks in, takes the single. Excellent start. Chuck. Without being perfectly timed, it'll be four. Come is, oh, that's brilliant. Really brilliant. Padun Nisanka is the name. And now he is out, surely. Yep. Pat Cummins wins that little battle then. Pat Cummins just got a little bit straight the ball before, and that ball just coming into middle and off stump. Slightly hit the ball in, in, inside out. He just hit the ball a tiny bit too early, which when you hit the bit of ball a bit early, you go a little bit inside out. Nisanka out for seven. Sri Lanka 15 for one. Charita Asalanka. Oh, and he is in form. <laughs> That's some stuff, huh? He tries your car, but the free hit works the way of the batsman. Oh, so there he goes. Hello, Glenn. Goodbye, Glenn. Well, you make your own luck. And the shots he's played so far have certainly brought that wide. safe certainly not timed and they'll pull it up i think yeah oh no unlucky for warner he threw himself at that ball and in the end couldn't control the flip back so the boundary goes asalanka's way oh he's got a top edge here he swiveled and he didn't know where it was but he does now it's four looks for the yorker again that's well bowled 50 partnership between Kusol Pereira and Jared Asalanka. He's had a go at this. He really has flailed this, and it's good enough to beat Steve Smith for four. Oh, he's creamed this as well. Oh, that's good. It's even better. Consecutive boundaries. That's heading to one of them, straight into the basket, Steve Smith. Three men back, it was a flat swat. Again the wrong and he drags it from outside off stump. A little bit of extra bounce gets the top edge, but not an easy catch because it was flat. It was hard, it's hard to judge here in Dubai. Asalanka, another wonderful innings of 35, Sri Lanka 78 for two. Vishka Fernando, the new batsman. Oh, how well, how well. Plenty of that. Goodness me, it just made the sound off the bat. Second tier. Kusel Pereira. Oh, beautifully. What a great response from Stark. That is superb. Just what you want. Amazing. Such drama in the first three balls. Yeah, great six. And then Starkey coming back with a... 90 mile per hour Yorker. Gusal Pereira on his way. 35, 86 for three now. Big wicket. Anuka Rajapaksa. Straight up. Should have another. Again, it's Steve Smith with those very safe hands. Swing across the line. Lovely bowling this from Adam Zampa. He is. Been superb tonight from an Australian point of view, pegging things back really well. The score's 90 for four. Asaranga's the new batsman. Oh, he's not fine enough. He's not fine enough. That man then erases away for four. Oh, yeah. Gone finer. Is there an edge? There is. There is an edge. 
Straight upstairs, though. Not sure I heard anything in my ear. The batsman had no hesitation. Let's listen in. I think you have a spike when the ball's next to the bat. I'll go back to Alim. You're on screen now. You can signal. Well done. Yeah. Ali Dar thought he heard it. He was spot on. I'm not sure why. There was a review from Hasaranga. Dustin Shanika. And backed up in the field. Oh, would have been gone. Would have been gone. Is that Mitch Marsh? It is. The bison throwing himself to the right. And a direct hit would have been out. Crunched. Absolutely crunched. No chance. Brilliant. He played the most amazing little. This is terrific stuff. Exactly as Shane Watson predicted. You have to target Steiners here. And, 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 and six. It's a brilliant free swing from Dustin Sharnika. And will be taken by Matthew Wade. With the gloves on, no problem. Change of pace into the wicket, just held up enough. And Shanika just wasn't able to adjust. Shanika, 12 off 19 balls. Sri Lanka now 134 for six. It's the new batsman. And lovely orthodox batting down the ground. Remarkable stroke. And uh, unlucky for Pat Cummins. I reckon it deserved four, that shot, though. <laughs> Ball. That's a confident performance from Josh Hazelwood today. And it finishes the innings. 20 overs completed with 154 for six on the board for Sri Lanka. David Warner. Aaron Finch. Hey. Width and punished. Finch gets a freebie and does not miss out. Again, he gets width and punishes it in front of square and away to the boundary for four more. Reverse and gets enough of it as well. One bounce and into the boundary for four. Yep. Oh, driven powerfully and away to the boundary for four. Finch. It's a wonderful drive from Aaron Finch. Oh my God. He's charged someone bowling at 148. That is a way over it. Third man into the boundary for six. Put down in the crowd. Oh, inside edge, he'll get away with it, Warner. Streaky boundary. They want to meet aggression with aggression. That's what the Aussies are doing. Oh, wow, that has hit hard. Warner's best of the innings so far. Down the ground for four, 20 off the over. Slow, high, and over long on. Might add four more to it. Yes, you will now with a little misfield. Oh, glove. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Floated through to the keeper. Off the gloves of David Warner. That is a chance gone begging. Well, Warner will get four more. Oh. There's no stopping these gaps are getting wider and wider. Oh, he's chopped on. He is chopped onto his stumps. And the heavy punishment for a moment. They are happy now, Sri Lankan fans. Aaron Finch, that was a sublime innings for 37 from 23. Where Maxwell has gone after it. And he's going to collect four. 
Oh, here he goes, here he goes, he pulls out the tricks. Here he goes. He goes big, but not big enough. Holds out of deep mid-wicket. Avisca Fernando waiting for the ball, waiting for something magical to happen, and it falls into his hands. Maxwell has gone for five of six, and Australia are now 80 for two. It's uh, put away through extra, and the ball will win that chase. Short, walloped, four. Pichana's last, and that's just a drag down into the gap. Yeah, very nice from Warner. Fifty up, and a fine half century for David Warner. His last half century was back in April in T20 cricket in the IPL. That's another slow one, I think. And Warner just pounces on it. And another great shot, that one on the up. Not really have any right to hit it in that direction, but it was just bludgeoned. Oh, that is timed. Is it timed well enough? No, it's not. Excellent catch. In the end, down on the long off boundary. Dave Warner. Just just a little bit in two minds. No, he wasn't in two minds. He just tried to hit it over cover. Just got it a little bit too straight, and that's a that's an excellent catch. Roger Pucks are running around there. Very nice. It's a big pocket, a bigger pocket there. Dave Warner, very nice inning. So great to see Dave Warner back in form. 65. Australia a 134-3. Marcus Stoinis out of the middle at number five. You can't call that a cricket stroke, it's a cricket thump. It's got absolutely miles. Up. That is a strong upper body doing that. I mean, obviously the timing, but my goodness. Stoinis again, in a way that's even better. Cracking stroke. And it takes Australia to a very impressive victory. If we said they weren't convincing against South Africa, we're sure that they were convincing today against Sri Lanka. So there you have it, 154 for six wasn't enough, as it was our guess, to be honest. 155 for three was the response. So Australia moved to four points along with England.